JAC Motors, a Chinese automaker backed by Volkswagen, has unveiled the world's first electric vehicle powered by a sodium ion battery. This is a groundbreaking achievement that could change the game for the EV industry. But what are sodium ion batteries and how do they work? And what are the advantages of using them over other types of batteries? Let's find out. The basic principles of a sodium ion battery are similar to those of a lithium ion battery. Both use electrolytes and electrodes to store and release energy. However, the key difference is the type of metal used in the electrodes. Lithium ion batteries use lithium, while sodium ion batteries use sodium. This difference in metal affects the battery's performance and characteristics. Sodium ion batteries, or Na ion batteries, are rechargeable batteries that use sodium ions as the main charge carriers. They work similarly to lithium ion batteries, which are the most common type of batteries used in EVs today, but they replace lithium with sodium as the cathode material. Sodium belongs to the same group in the periodic table as lithium and thus has similar chemical properties. However, sodium has some key differences that make it a promising alternative to lithium. Lithium ion batteries have dominated the EV landscape for years, but they have their limitations. Lithium is a scarce and expensive resource, and the batteries can be prone to overheating and safety issues. Enter sodium ion batteries. These batteries use sodium, a much more abundant and cheaper element than lithium, making them a potentially more sustainable and affordable option. One of the main advantages of sodium ion batteries is that they are cheaper and more abundant than lithium ion batteries. Lithium is a scarce and expensive metal that is mainly found in a few countries, such as Chile, Australia, and China. This creates supply chain issues and environmental concerns for the lithium ion battery industry. Sodium, on the other hand, is widely available and can be extracted from seawater, salt lakes, or underground deposits. This means that sodium ion batteries can be produced at a lower cost and with less environmental impact than lithium ion batteries. Another advantage of sodium ion batteries is that they have better performance and safety than lithium ion batteries. Sodium ion batteries have a higher operating voltage, which means that they can store more energy per unit of weight. They also have a faster charging speed, a longer lifespan, and a higher tolerance to extreme temperatures than lithium ion batteries. Moreover, sodium ion batteries are less prone to overheating, catching fire, or exploding, which are some of the major safety risks of lithium ion batteries. So, how does JAC Motors' new sodium ion battery EV compare to other EVs on the market? Well, the vehicle is called Huashenzi, which means flower fairy in Chinese, and it is based on Jack's existing IEVA electric platform. It is equipped with a 25 kilowatt hour sodium ion battery pack from Heiner Battery Technologies, a Beijing-based company that is affiliated with the Institute of Physics of the Chinese Academy of Sciences. The vehicle can travel up to 250 kilometers on a single charge and can be recharged from 10% to 80% in 20 minutes. The vehicle is expected to be delivered to customers next month and will cost around 100,000 yuan or about 15,000 US dollars. That isn't to say that sodium ion is flawless. Compared to lithium ion batteries, this battery type has a lower density, which means that they aren't suitable for large size vehicles. Its size is measured at 25 kilowatt hours only, meaning that it only has a range of 250 kilometers, at most. That's approximately half of what other EVs offer, and slightly more than a quarter of the maximum recharge distance of the recently announced Xiaomi SU7 maximum. However, given the Heine sodium ion battery's capacity, charging it from 10% to 80% should take around 20 minutes is a good thing. JAC Motors is not the only company that is working on sodium ion battery technology. CATL, the world's largest lithium ion battery maker, announced last year that it had started mass production of sodium ion batteries. Other companies, such as Viradian, Tiamat, Northvolt, and Natron Energy, are also developing sodium ion batteries for various applications, such as stationary storage, grid services, and backup power. Sodium ion batteries are expected to play a significant role in the future of energy storage and transportation, as they offer a low-cost, high-performance, and environmentally friendly solution. JAC Motors sodium ion battery is a significant step forward for the EV industry. It has the potential to make EVs more affordable, accessible, and environmentally friendly. 
while there are still some challenges to overcome, such as improving energy density and production scale, the future of sodium ion batteries looks bright. They could be the key to unlocking a new era of sustainable transportation. We also made a video on the smartphone manufacturing companies that are also working on making their own electric vehicles. From Apple to Xiaomi, Huawei to Oppo and many more, click the link above and in the description to watch it. That's all for today's video. I hope you learned something new and interesting about sodium ion batteries and JAC Motors' new EV. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. And don't forget to leave a comment below and let me know what you think about sodium ion batteries and JAC Motors' new EV. Thanks for watching and see you next time.